I am lucky. I'm very lucky. I'm the only person surviving from the ship. I will wait a little now till I am found and saved. Four days passed. I am so unlucky. Everyone who was with me on the ship died quickly and easily by drowning in the ocean. But I will have to die alone and painful death without food and water. It was so silly of me to hope that I will be found and saved. No one will find me here and no one will save me. The next day. Land, land, I'm saved, I'm saved. Three hours later. This is an island, this is just an island. But this island has at least food and drinking water. It means I will not die of thirst and hunger. This island is like a dream. It looks like a paradise. But I am alone here. I am absolutely alone here. I am almost sure that not a single human lives on this island. And it's so terrible, I don't even have anyone to talk to. Hello, my name is Olivia, and what is yours? Olivia, you scared me so much, my name is Chris. I am so happy that you appeared on this island, Chris. I used to be here all alone. Do you mean there are not other people on this island except you? Well, there is also a sleeping man, but he sleeps all the time. Who is that sleeping man? He is the one who is dreaming of this island, you and me, while he is sleeping. Well, I can't understand anything. Can't you understand? You are so stupid. I understood everything at once. You and I are just a dream of the man who is sleeping on this island. I can see you don't believe me, but I am telling you the truth. You and I are just a dream of the sleeping man. If he wakes up, will disappear. She is out of her mind. She has been alone on this island for too long. Follow me, I'll show you the sleeping man. You'll see him and understand that I'm telling you the truth. Can you see him now? He is lying here and sleeping. He never, never wakes up. And this whole paradise island, including me and you, are just his dream. But he is not breathing, he is dead. I'll approach him now and prove that he is dead. No, you mustn't approach him. Even animals don't approach him. It's dangerous, you can accidentally wake him up. And if he wakes up, we all will disappear. You are really out of your mind. You have been living here alone for too long, that's why you are crazy now. And your sleeping man is just a mummy. I think some ancient people who used to live on this island made this mummy. Chris, please, don't speak so loudly. 
Let's go away from here. We mustn't wake him up. Wait, Olivia, where are we going? Don't ask me stupid questions. We are going to my house, of course. Do you have your own house on this island? Of course I have my own house. I need a place to live in. You are so stupid. I live here. This is my house. You really have your own house. But who built it on this deserted island? Did you build it yourself? Of course not. You are so stupid. You didn't understand anything. The sleeping man saw this house in his dream. That's why I have it now. Come inside the house now. You will live with me now. Wow, you have such a luxurious interior of your house. But how? Where did you get all the things on the deserted island? I explained it to you several times. The sleeping man saw all the things in his dream. Unfortunately, his dreams are not always good. He can see bad dreams too. Let's go. I will show you your room now. Two days later. A lake? How could this lake appear here? It was not here yesterday. I remember it for sure. The sleeping man saw this lake in his dream. Stop telling me about the sleeping man. I think water rose from underground sources at night and formed this lake. Next day. Elephants? This island has elephants? Olivia! Olivia! Olivia, why didn't you tell me that there were elephants on the island? Elephants? There were no elephants on the island before. Do you want to tell me now that the elephants appeared here because a sleeping man saw them in his dream? Yes, exactly. That was the way they appeared here. Next day. Seals? But why? How could the seals go get to the tropical island? Some weird things are happening on this island. Something is definitely wrong with this island. If I don't find out what is really going on here, I'll go mad. Olivia, Olivia, I must do it. What, what must you do? I must see the sleeping man again. No, Chris, please, you mustn't do that. You can accidentally wake him up. And then all the sins will disappear. You and me will disappear too. I'm so much afraid of that. We have such a comfortable life here. I don't care. I will go right now and wake up the sleeping man. You can't prevent me from doing that. Okay, you can go, but I'll go with you. I want to make sure that you'll just look at him without touching him. Okay, let's go together. That's enough, Chris. Let's go away from here. You have been staring at him for a very long time. 
I am trying to understand who were those people who made this unique mummy. Hey, look, he moved. Don't be stupid, it was the wind which made you believe that he was moving. No, it wasn't the wind. I think he has bad dreams now. And it can be dangerous for us. Let's go home, Chris. Okay, let's go home. I hope we'll be safe here in the house. I am sure the sleeping man had a bad dream. And that's why we should be very careful. Oh no, Chris, look, there is a monster there. What monster? Stop saying stupid things. Run, Chris, fast, outside. Let's run to the sleeping man. Faster, Olivia, faster. Chris, wake up the sleeping man, fast. It better disappear than he will kill me. The sleeping man? I was that sleeping man. But where is the Paradise Island? The Paradise Island disappeared too. I am on a lifeless rocky island actually. I am doomed. I will not survive here. The end.